right, you claim you were knocked out after the earthquake. Yes, sir. Don't bother calling me sir, it's not gonna matter. Because you're gonna torture me anyway? You don't work that way anymore. Now you just go to the darkest corner of the room. Great. How long were you unconscious? Sun had set when I came to. There was a broadcast. Were you out for six hours? Eight? It's important. Is that a train? Try to point? focus on the question, please. Yeah, I was still shaky as hell when I pulled myself out, so I don't know. It was dark. Pulled yourself out? You were buried? I did see something. You just said it was dark and you were groggy. Are you trying to get a rise out of me? We're just along for the ride, Sergeant Blackburn. You're driving, for now. If you say so. So it was dark and you were groggy. You saw something after the quake. What was it? On the other hand, I have a better idea. I let you choose. Choose. Choose what? Oh, come on. What is it? Live or die. Live or die, mister. Him <laughs>
Ich habe einen Ich I'm glad to see you. In about half an hour, this place is gonna be every fucking man for himself. Come on, let's get the fuck out of here. Misfit, this is Misfit 1-3. I think I'm almost back at the staging area. I don't know, this place looks real different without any frickin' buildings. I got the door. Come on. Stop me if this is incorrect. Farouk Al-Bajir and the PLR seize power in Iran almost the same day as the earthquake. They become a threat. A few weeks later, we send in 50,000 Marines to take them out. We go to war in Iran. Is this a history lesson? What part did you play in going after Al-Bashir? That's a broad question. Well, then I will narrow it down. Your first mission. Initially, our role was to do BDA after airstrikes in the northern quarter of Tehran. Battle damage assessment. Why were you doing that? 
It was procedure. We were looking for a high-value target Fast Air was supposed to hit. So far as I can tell, you don't have a great history of following procedure. Tell me about your interaction with Lieutenant Colby Hawkins. She was an F-18 pilot? She? Don't know her. As you went in, she took part in an airstrike on Al-Bashir. Hawkins, we just got raised to alert one. Plans have changed. We're launching now. CAG says we're special today. We're not on station for some whiskey delta ground support. Dask is going to fill us in airborne. We're going to be flying a strike mission over Tehran into Maribad Airport. Eland has sat images. They think they know where Al Bashir is. So, get your fangs out, Hawkins. We're hunting big game today. That's pretty much it. There's Iranian bogeys in the air already. Pucker factor, 9.7. Farouk Al-Bashir is about to have a really bad day. Okay, let's rock and roll.
Coming up on your nine. Roger. I'm getting multiple sand signals coming from the airport. We're just on Bulldog 3-2. Pocket, switch over to targeting pod and take him out.
seconds. They're boarding the helicopter. We have individuals running. You are cleared to take them out too. Roger, three seconds. Power, power. 